there is this um, beautiful woman um, who keeps forgetting things. She keeps forgetting. It's like she can move from the kitchen to the uh, uh, sitting room to get something. And before she gets there, she doesn't even know why she left the kitchen for the sitting room. And uh, she will assign her children to do certain things. And later she will even forget to control because she, she cannot even remember if she's the one who asked this child to do this. Yeah, I think. And um, this kind of situation, yeah, I'm not, a, I'm not a medical doctor or I cannot help in this kind of situation. Uh, but I think there are also some habits that can, that can help someone. But the very first thing I would say, she should go for medical medical attention. She should seek for help, you know, from uh, yeah her doctor or so. Um, but there are also some little things that uh, uh, she can do uh, at home um, that I think um, can help her to you know to be focused maybe on a particular thing. And I think in. in um, and then combining that also with the medication or the counseling that she can get from the from the yeah her doctor also it can help her um so i read a book and this book was written by a, a, a medical professional um this lady uh, by the time she was writing this book i think she was 96 or something and so she tried to explain how she helped a friend yeah, she had, she helped a friend who had this kind of problem. And so what did she advise the friend to do? This friend had mobility problems. So uh, the man was just, I would say, could just live around his compound. And so he asked this friend um, to buy a potted plant. So a plant, uh, a plant that you can plant in a pot or in a container. It can be anything. And then advise this man to place this plant in a position that he has access so nothing should stop him from examining how this plant is growing and so the assignment that he had to do was to water this plant at a particular time every two days and then he should have a sheet of paper to note the time that he's watering this plant and um, he had something like a cylinder but that may not be necessary you can just use your small cup with water and so to take uh, to take note of the quantity of water that he was pouring on that plant and then uh, another thing he had a ruler he had a ruler to be measuring how this plant was growing and he should also try to note the first day that he noticed that the plant was blooming. That's he started producing flowers. So he said, she said in the beginning, the man said, no, he cannot do this. That is too much work. He does. He just likes to go sit outside, you know, in the sun and enjoy. He doesn't want to take care of some nonsense flower. What is a plant? What is a flower? But I will tell you, this lady. Uh, advised this man he gave the man the name of the plant that he will buy and so this plant was a plant that uh, was almost at maturity and so was going to produce flowers within uh, uh, two weeks or so and these flowers were very beautiful so she succeeded to convince this man and this man bought this flower he had this paper he had this piece of paper the ruler the pencil and each time he set his alarm and then you know what was even interesting is that when the lady came after four days the man told him you know what i don't need an alarm anymore to go water those plants because when it is almost time to water the plant, I just remember that I need to water this plant and I'm waiting to see those flowers. So before he knew it, he fell in love with this activity to water this plant after two days, to take down the information, to measure the plant. And the day the plants, you know, started producing flowers, he called that lady. They celebrated. And I'll tell you, this man's life has never been the same again. 
he finds joy and now instead of taking care of this potted plant in his apartment he decided to buy other plants and plant them in his garden he waters these plants he admires them so please if you are having this kind of problem that you lack concentration, you cannot focus, or you can try something like this. It can be any plant around your environment. It must not be an, um, an exotic plant that you need to import or so. We have a lot of flowers everywhere. Just try something like this, and I think it's going to help you. I know people with disabilities, this can be a mental health issue, but also some people with disabilities have problems, you know, to stay focused or to remember, or they even lack the courage to focus on a particular activity. Train yourself with this flower, and please, you can tell someone about this if they are suffering from the same situation.